are going to be doing a hair product video and we're going to be trying out something super super interesting so recently i got sent this um one step hair dryer from plavogue and i've been dying to try it because i've seen a lot of these types of hair dryers on the market um and you know they look super interesting because they're supposed to style and dry your hair all in one step and you're supposed to be able to get like that salon blowout type look at home super fast and easy so basically this is like a hair dryer and um round brush in one that's supposed to really easily style your hair and give you like that nice volume and smoothness and um you're supposed to be able to really easily style your hair so i did use it today if you want to see me try out this product right here as well as learn how to get that salon blowout look at home just keep on watching all right so let's just get started my hair is pretty damp right now i would say about 75 percent dry which is exactly where you want it to be when you're using a product like this or even if you're just blow drying your hair with a regular blow dryer um you don't want your hair to be soaking wet you don't want it to be completely dry either so 75 percent dry 25 percent damp is exactly where you want it to be so i've been air drying it for a little bit here while i was doing my makeup and getting ready so now we're ready to do the hair here is the product right here as i mentioned in the beginning of this video this product is from plavogue um and they have a bunch of really cool hairstyling products on their website i'm on it right now and they have like one of those um, hair colors that kind of sucks up your hair and curls it for you they also have a hair straightener that has like the um curved blades i'm gonna post some pictures on the screen so you guys can see but the product we're gonna be trying today is this one step hair dryer now i have seen products like this all over the market um like dyson has a really popular one um revlon a bunch of different brands are coming out with stuff like this and i'm really excited to try this one right here because it's supposed to be really good so this is the one step hair dryer it's like a hot comb so it's basically like a comb and hair dryer in one that's supposed to make it super easy for you to um style your hair and get like that salon blowout look at home and make it really easy to just dry and style your hair at the same time so this uses negative ion technology and also has heat resistant grip um so some really cool technology parts to it it also comes in two colors so the one i have this like rose gold and white oh my gosh it is way bigger than i thought it was going to be so here is the product yeah this is like a lot bigger than i thought it was gonna be this is like a monstrosity but it's not super heavy it's a little manual i love boxes like these um i always keep them because they're great for like either reusing the box or storing your hair product in them so let's see here is there any important just unpackage this and here are the bristles so it's like the, supposed to be that charcoal bristle and on the side ones it has like the little kind of bristles with the like shorter ones right here and then on the front it's just like regular comb bristles and the brush is an oval shape which usually brushes like round brushes are usually round so i'm excited to see how the oval shape kind of plays into it if that's going to help with like smoothing the hair out or anything and then we have on and off here i love the like look of it it's so pretty actually and the cord which is fairly long actually it's a nice weight too like i don't feel like my hand's gonna get too too tired using it because sometimes hair tools are so heavy that they're just a pain to use so this feels like a good weight and it's so big that i'll definitely be able to get my hair done pretty fast hopefully so i just plugged it in but i'm gonna brush out my hair and i am using like a wet brush so um i don't have to worry too much about the hair being wet and brushing it and then I'm gonna part my hair in the middle because that's how I want it to be styled. And I'm just going to section the hair. So I'm gonna take my hair kind of in half and clip up this top part. Just gonna turn it off to talk. So it is heating up actually while that's like going. Um, just like a blow dryer, but then it has the brush. So I'm just gonna turn it back on.
that side is done and I actually was able to take pretty big sections and then I just like kind of curled the ends out a little bit and that smoothed it out really nicely. It was really, really fast too. So I'm just going to do the other side off camera and then we'll get started on the top section. Okay, so the bottom section is now done and it gave a really nice curl at the end. I am kind of curling it as you guys saw, but it's really, really nice. The hair's super soft and not frizzy at all, which is so, so good. So I'm just going to take down the top now and I'm just going to try to do this in two sections because the easier... And faster I get this done, the more I'm going to like this product. So I'm just going to start at the back. I'm actually going to grab a thicker piece because this is pretty good at getting a lot of hair done at once. guys so here is this side i think that looks pretty good um it definitely like kind of straightened it out and gave my ends that little bit of like curl too which is what i was looking for so i'm gonna go do the other side on camera and then i'll be back to talk about like my final thoughts and everything all right so i finished both sides and it is like pretty smooth and my ends have like that nice bit of curl to them I am going to really quick kind of give my bangs a bit more of that curl so I'm just gonna grab them kind of bring them to the center and go up So once I formed the shape I liked, I switched it to the cool setting so that it would lock the style in and that curl would really stay put. So you can see how that curled really well. So what I did, I put it on the hot, styled it, and then turned it on the middle section, which is the cool section. And you can see how that really just locked that in place. Here is the hair. As you can see, I'm just going to stand up real quick. As you can see it has that really nice like curl to it at the bottom the brush gave me lots and lots of volume without it being frizzy I like how it kind of did my curtain bags too because my hair is super long obviously it's not gonna have like too much curl to it it is gonna go more straight really like how it just styled my hair in general um i think it feels really soft it's not frizzy and usually I will dry my hair with a blow dryer or I'll let it air dry and then I'll get this exact same style with a hair straightener. So it's just that extra step. So this really lived up to its name of being that one step hair dryer where you can style and dry your hair in the same go. And obviously you could use a round brush and hair dryer to do this exact same process, but um, 
you know, having it all in one tool and using only one hand to do it is really, really um, easy. And I've done my hair with a round brush and blow dryer before, and it just takes a lot more time, you know, um, and especially if you haven't had as much practice with it, you know, your hands get all jumbled up and the hair gets tangled and it's a whole mess. So this was super easy to use. And I think a lot of you guys would actually like this if you're looking to style your hair and get more of that um, salon blowout type look without having to go to the salon. You can just do it at home. Um, um, of course, if you have shorter hair or more layers, you're going to be able to get that volume and that kind of flipped out look. I'll put some pictures on the screen of what I'm talking about more easily than, um, you know, I can because my hair is pretty long and I do have some layers, but they're not um, super like distinct. So um, yeah, this is the style I usually like to do when I try to go for that look and I achieved it really easily with this product. And I think it's something I'm going to be using a lot to style my hair. I also like that it has the knob here so you can kind of turn it and use your other hand to guide you. Um, and I did actually like that oval shape. I think it actually helped in kind of smoothing out the hair more and making it more straight. So I think there's a lot of flexibility with this. If you want to just do straight, just go straight down. If you want to add some curl, you know, give it that curl. If you want more volume at the top, just hold it up higher. And then, as I said, use the cool feature, which is the middle one, to make sure the hair stays locked in that style. So if you didn't know, you're supposed to use the heat to form the style you want. And then to make it hold, go on the cool function for just a few seconds, hold it there. Now really hold those curls in, which is what I did and it worked out really well.